Morgan from Wildly Fit and I got a little bit of a uh, vloggy style video. Um, I have been hiking for hours, well not just me, Brad too. <laughs> um, we've been hiking for hours. We are on the Maitland Trail. Uh, that's one of the advantages of being on vacation is we have access to a truck and we get to drive to some awesome things to do like going on this hike and thought we would take you along for a little bit of it. We're about halfway through the hike to maybe share some do's with you or actually maybe a little bit of a don't. We were super foolish and the hike started at the beach and what we did was we were like, huh, we're a little bit hungry even though we did pack a lot of food and ended up going to the chip truck before we got on the trail. So we had some fried food foolishly. So maybe that's a little bit of a don't before you go hiking. But um, yeah, we'll show you a bit more of the trail. Say hi. Okay. And maybe what we pack for snacks and stuff like that. All right, time for some snackage. That's snacks. And Brad, what are you unpacking? Sandwich. Can you speak up? Chicken sandwich. Chicken sandwich. What else? Cookies. Speak up. Cookies. Uh, and water. Yes. How much water? Two bottles. Not enough water. Not enough. Can we tell everyone on the video how much water you need hiking? Apparently two liters. Two liters. Especially on a hot day, and today is very hot. Okay, in case you didn't know, you are looking at an ooh-ah point. Um, <laughs> I laughed at this so much because I've actually been on this part of the trail. It's uh, two trails overlap right at this point and I've been on the Gart Trail tons of times, never seen this so it must be brand new. And I think what the UA is telling you to look at is this, which is the Maitland River, which is basically what we are following for the Maitland Trail. Now I should say we're not doing the entire Maitland Trail, that's 48 kilometers. Uh, we're just doing a portion of it today, but there is the beautiful river, which the trail follows. What are you doing? Uh, I'm having an internal conversation about whether I want to change my socks or not. Uh, I always like bringing an extra pair of socks when I'm doing a like long day of anything. Um, but there's also the fact that my feet are just like mashed into these shoes and kind of swollen right now. So I don't know, the whole taking off the shoe thing and then putting them back on might feel like murder, but new socks might feel good. That's my dilemma. All right, we are uh, literally in the last couple kilometers of our hike and we are exhausted and the sun is starting to drop, um, but we have had an awesome time. We are on, you know, I don't know what this bridge is called and it's probably pretty windy up here. So I'm gonna stop talking, but I'm gonna give you a little panorama. We are leaving the beach back in the car. Uh, just finished the hike and total hiking time comes in at almost exactly four hours. So it was a longie, but it was very fun and um, wildernessy. Yes, I would use those words. Um, there were a couple parts of the trail that you actually had to walk um, on one of the country highways, uh, which wasn't as awesome, but all in all, a very fun four hours. And just so you know, I didn't change my socks, so I'm about to take my shoes off, and I am very happy about that. What What are we looking at? Curves. Oh, there's a curves if you want to go to the gym after your four hour hike, <laughs> which I don't. I think that we're going for ice cream. So. Anyways, I hope you like this vlog style video. I'm on vacation, uh, that's why I'm shooting a little bit more casual this week because vacation is casual and that's it. So head on over to wildlyfit.ca to see all of my content and all of my social links are linked in the video description below.